Ash, come here. <laughs> done my hair now. Just done for uh, the wider barrel from the Dyson Airwrap collection. Um, basically, today I am going to be picking up my wedding dress with my mum and my sister. It's going to be so exciting. Today, today's agenda um, is going to be me getting my nails done and then I'm going to get a pedicure as well. And then I'm going to have breakfast with them. And then um, I've got my wedding dress appointment at 3.30. And then I think we're just chilling this evening and not really doing anything. We went out last night with some friends um, and it was a bit of a late one. So it's quite nice to just have a little break. And it's a bank holiday weekend. So we've literally got like, well, I've not got the week off. So I've got ages to just do whatever I want. So let's just, we were like stressing out about because we've got so much to do this weekend. But like, it is what it is. So anyway, um... I'm gonna just do like very, very minimal makeup. I like to start with, obviously I've moisturized on my skincare, but I will take my Too Faced multi Sculpting Concealer in the shade Golden Beige, and it is so dirty. I don't know why it just like oozes the product, but it does. So I put this oh, very minimally in the sense that it's giving Hailey Bieber in that one video. A little bit on that spot there. I just blend that out but also like almost pat that into the skin take my wet sponge and press that and make sure it's all blended i'm just gonna take the tiniest bit of cream bronzer these are so pigmented i just i love them so much i have to go because ben has to wait for me excuse me where am I gonna sit? So we are back from town now. Um, I met Ben and we had a quick brunch and then we went to Sainsbury's to do a food shop but I just wanted to show you guys my nails I didn't get them super long or anything but they are so cute I'm obsessed with this color oh it's quarter to three have I got enough time to nap because I've got to be at my dress appointment for 3 30 also I went to Waterstones today had all the strength in me because I didn't get anything and I went to Sainsbury's and I also didn't get anything, but they didn't really have anything that I either wanted or didn't have yet. Okay, I'm just rambling on. Um, but I did bring my Kindle with me whilst I was waiting for um, for me to get my nails done. Because there's quite a few people in because it's a Saturday. And I read quite a bit of sorry, The Perfect Marriage. And that is actually a really good moment. I need to, I need to go and try and nap, I guess. Let's take my contacts off. And I'm about to have a movie night and we are going to use a DVD and we wanted to watch this ages ago but I didn't want to pay like nine pounds on Amazon to rent it so when I was house sitting at my mum's and I was like cleaning up their room I literally found this was mine it is sealed and it's the Twilight Saga but this was so early that as you could see all it has is Twilight, New Moon, Eclipse and breaking dawn part one so we don't even have breaking dawn part two so yeah but we're gonna we're gonna unbox it now so we're gonna watch it because ben has never watched twilight and i personally was offended by that so we are starting with twilight the series here and i want to show you what we got just because i am so excited we're just having a little movie night tonight New Adam Sandler movie dropped, so you know that's what we're gonna be after. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna show you. I've had this once before and I was such a fan. So we've got their nachos, which right, ready? Ready? Beautiful. 
absolutely beautiful. Then got like a spicy chicken burrito. Then we also picked up full burrito tacos because this bad boy's up. Mm. I feel like today's vlog has not been like anything crazy because I went to get my dress but I obviously couldn't really film it because I'm not trying to upload what my dress looks like before the wedding. Um, so yeah, I don't, I don't know, I don't know, but this is what we're doing. We've been doing a bunch of admin work, just been chilling. So hopefully more footage to come. It is Saturday morning. I've just come out of the shower. What is on the agenda today? And I've done a little bit of reading in bed. I've been up since half seven. Um, just chilled around so I think this morning what we're going to do is just I'm going to do a little bit more laundry just because uh, there's just a lot and I just want to get out of the way and then um, take Ash out for her walk and then we are also going to have breakfast at home but basically we are going to hopefully go out for the day um, I'd like to go somewhere like Brighton hopefully we can go out for some food um, and buy a book or two. Hi baby, good morning. Oh, Sri Lanka. So we are just getting some petrol quickly, well, Venice anyway. Um, and then we are going to Brighton. Um, I think we're just gonna have a little wander around. I wanna buy a couple of accessories um, for tomorrow. And then um, I wanted to buy some jeans because um, I had two pairs, I literally had two pairs of jeans, one split by the butt, and so obviously I'm not wearing that. And the second one isn't like a, like an everyday jean, so it's kind of annoying. So I really want to buy a new pair of just your egg, everyday, everyday pair of jeans. And then um, I think we're going to go to a Filipino restaurant for some dinner, lunch, dinner, whatever. Um, so yeah. Um, I haven't been to Brighton in a really long time like to go out because I work there basically so it's I don't like driving down there because it makes me like feel like I'm going to work so this yeah it's been a while since we've been so I'm very excited because it is like our favorite place to go to we used to live there I went to university there um but yeah I don't know why I'm giving you guys a life story yeah we're going to Brighton <laughs> get like much at all because we weren't really shopping like that but i did obviously pick up a few things what is going on with the hair girl i bought these earrings from primark just because i thought they were already cute and dainty and they're like two pound fifty and there's a whole bunch of them um and the good thing about primark jewelry is that if i wear them and i lose them it is what it is like i'm not too bothered i bought a couple of things from um you tell me from h&m but i just picked up these set of rings which i thought were just really cute and because they're green um i wanted to wear gold rings tomorrow um at my friend's wedding and my dress is yellow and green so i thought this would be really cute um and then i picked up these earrings which i think i'm also gonna wear just some chunky like big gold hoops and then i picked up a plant so ben and i went for this birds of paradise let me show you. Look at her. She is magic. She is grace. And she is beautiful. This is our new plant. Ben bought me four books. And I'm so excited. So we went to the works. And I picked Meet Me at the Lake by Carly Fortune. I'm currently reading Every Summer After. And really enjoying it. Although I've heard many people say that this isn't as good at all. But it is what it is. I'm still going to read it. And it was only £2.50. It was part of the three for six pound deal, but I didn't really see anything else that I wanted. So I thought I would just pick this up. So Ben got me this one. And then we went to Waterstones and the one in Brighton hits. And I found three books that I've wanted, but I couldn't decide. And I asked Ben to pick and he said I could get all three. So I got all three. Um, I'm really excited for this one. It's The Book Eaters by Sunny Dean. And I have heard so many good things about this and I cannot wait to read more like fantasy 
um, books in the autumn winter time which is literally like around the corner so this book is about a world where people literally eat books and like if you eat say like a romance something it's like a delicious sweet treat or whatever so yeah people eat the books instead of reading them i guess but i don't know too much else about it which is how i prefer it because obviously i want to go into it as blind as possible but yeah i'm so happy to oh my god look how tiny the font is scary okay loranda reads have been talking about this so i am very excited and then the next two books i have i am so excited about but it is lillian fishman's acts of service and i'm so glad that they released this one because i swear the only other one i could see was like an off balance like a really long copy like a really long edition but yeah um i don't really know much about this apart from I've seen this make its rounds on booktube so i thought i would grab this one and then last but not least i found this version of daddy by emma klein i wasn't the biggest fan of the girls by emma klein but i still enjoyed it i'm still gonna read this and the guest her latest release i believe because i don't know i still enjoyed it really it was it's not that i wasn't the biggest fan i just think i had higher expectations for it i still rated it three star but whatever but i also found that this was a signed copy so yeah i've got a signed emma klein book um also i just love the covers like i just love that um anyway so those are the things that i bought and yeah okay so we had the wedding last night so i don't really film anything there but um we're taking a little bit of a turn because the weather if i if i can show you do you see how autumn-y it is outside my house right now what am i deciding to do instead of relaxing basically i've got the whole week off work so what i'm going to do is have a proper refresh reset um so right now we are in my makeup like getting ready room but Ben's clothes have always been in this cupboard and then my clothes have been in the wardrobe in the bedroom and I thought surely it makes sense for me to just absolutely monopolize this room so what I'm going to do is well what I've started doing is going through all of my clothes and all my summer clothes I'm going to put away because it it is getting chilly now and like I'm, I'm ready for autumn so I'm getting all my clothes in here and then Ben's clothes over there and then we're also going through them to see if there's anything we could sell donate anything like that it's just nice to have like a like a spring clean but like in the autumn so that's what we're gonna do and I feel like it would just be a nice way to spend the week to just slowly organize myself refresh ready for the new season and also I don't know there's something about autumn that i just absolutely love anyway but it will be my birthday in october we're going to mexico for a couple of weeks but it's also going to be my 30th birthday which feels like another like a big chapter that i'm gonna enter in and when i turn 30 is kind of like where things seem to be slotting into place i qualify as a solicitor i get married there's just so many good things happening all at once so i think i'm just slowly transitioning myself into that part of my life and what better way than to declutter my house and i'm gonna try and tackle the books because guys let me show you how silly it's getting so this is like my main bookshelf but it literally is like i'm stacking them that way now even though that bit's full as well um like i'm sorry but why yeah um and i've got a stack here let me show you where else right now i just bought four new books that are downstairs but i also have this bookcase here and then i've got stack there stack there we've got books there and then we've also got some books down here so yeah So this is what 
the room looks like right now. It's not messy, really. It's just I want to just put everything away. There's just little bits that's been left out. And then I can just have all this floor space sort through all my books because I want to lay them out and just do it that way. So, yeah. <laughs> what I'm going to do is have a little break because I wanted to read a couple of chapters of every summer after then once I've got that I'm gonna go have some lunch and then after I have lunch I might carry on and do a little bit of the spare room or I might just leave that until tomorrow and then because those are really the only two things I need to do there's the spare room next door and then um, if I have time under the stairs and this little cupboard that we've got in the hallway here. Um, but yeah, I've got plenty of time to do all of that. So I'm not too fast, but yeah, I'm gonna read a little bit of this. It is currently, what is the time? 25 past one in the afternoon. So we've got, we've, we've done, we've done well actually for what I've done this morning. Um, and yeah, I'm just gonna have a little bit of a read, chill here for a minute and then I will do whatever else I, I need to do today. All right, guys. Oh my God, my hair. My hair. Okay, so it is Thursday now. It's probably about, let's see what time it is. It is nearly 2.30 in the afternoon. Um, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here, purely because I'm not doing anything else and I've literally spent all day playing Sims, doing some wedding admin, doing some life admin and watching Gilmore Girls. So yeah, I hope you guys had a fun time with this little snippet of a week in my life. If you did, then let me know if you want to see more of these and give the video a thumbs up. If you haven't yet, please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!